in Western Slope. It is another week, another Montrose Monday with Tanya Maddox. Tanya, how you doing? I'm doing fabulous. How are you? I'm doing well. So what do we have coming up here in Montrose? I believe we have something going on today. We do. Oh my gosh. Okay. So it is Special Olympics bowling today and it'll actually be every Monday for the rest of the month. But athletes with intellectual disabilities, um, they're going to learn different techniques. They're going to learn skills and then they're just going to compete in an environment where it's fun and safe. And that starts at 530 until 630 at uh, Rose Bowl here in Montrose. Awesome. And you had said you said that this is going on every Monday for this month. Is that Exactly. Okay. Every Monday this month at the same time. So we'll have the Special Olympics bowling. Awesome. That sounds amazing. And I think we have something coming up on Thursday is the next event, right? What's that? Yes. For all those boomers and seniors <laughs> out there, it's Beacon Fest Montrose. And we're going to have to compare notes to see if Montrose or Grand Junction, you know, was better. But Absolutely. it is live music. It's at the pavilion. Um, there's going to be all sorts of resources for people. Um, you can sample some delicious food. But Beacon Fest, 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. at the Montrose Pavilion. Yeah, Tanya, I, I think it's going to be hard to beat Grand Junction's Beacon Fest. I will say it was rocking in there. I mean, music playing, everything going on, food, different vendors. But I'm sure it's going to be much the same up there in Montrose. Um, and then here on Saturday as well, we have something coming up. What is it? You know what? The botan botanical gardens, they they just come up with fun activities. <laughs> so back in June, they um, planted, you know, some uh, just different items that you can put on a pizza. And it's time to harvest those items. So it is going to be a pizza garden harvest. And um, it's from 10 a.m. to noon. So we're going to harvest all those things that were planted in June. And then everyone gets to make their own pizza. It's perfect for ages um, 3 through 12 with a grown-up. But anyone can come. And it's a free event. Okay. That sounds totally awesome. I mean, I hadn't heard of this before. I mean, but what a great idea to plant some vegetables that you can just throw on a pizza, have some fun with it later on. Are they making the pizzas at the Botanical Garden or is it just the veggies there? That, no, I think that's my understanding. They're okay. going to make their pizza pies there, so it should be a good time. Okay, awesome. Well, Tanya, is there anything else coming up that we should be aware of or was that that's all for this week? That's all for this week, but beware next week. We've got a bounty of events to talk about. Okay. <laughs> all right, perfect. Well, Western Soap, be on the lookout next week as well. But Tanya, thank you so much for joining me. You're welcome. You're of course. Well, Western Soap, we're going to go ahead and take a quick commercial break. We'll be right back.